So, Jared. Yeah. What's up? There's going to be another nuke today. Another? Our third one? Yes, our third nuke. Uh-oh. What's this one called? This one is called the helium bomb because the hydrogen bomb has already been detonated in the 1900s. But this one is now the helium bomb, or B-84. Okay. All right, what do we need to do? I'm just oh, going the same yeah. spot we did last time and okay. grab our walkie-talkies, which are right there. Okay, give me my talkie-walkie. I'll call the talkie walkie. Walkie talkie, I got it. Okay, let's yeah. test them. All right. Testing over. It works. Excellent. All right, let's. All right, let's. Okay. I'm right. going to hide in the fridge. Go in the fridge because you did that every time we tried to do it. My spot over. And you survive. All right, and you talk to Jared. Hey, Jared? Jared? Wait. All right, guys. I I'm need in the refrigerator. Over. Good. I need to talk to the viewers, so you won't hear me if you try to talk to me. Sounds good. Over. All right, guys. So this new bomb is called the helium bomb because the hydrogen one has already been detonated. And the hydrogen one's real name was like B83 or something. This one is called B84. Or the helium bomb. Because this one has helium instead of hydrogen. I'm so scared. I need to tell Jared that it activates in a minute. Hey, Jared? Yes, Nick. Over. It's activating in 40 seconds. Good. Over. Guys, this is crazy. Jared? Do you know if some ice will melt in your fridge because there's ice in there and it might melt and flood you? Do you think that will happen? Do you think that will happen? It did a time, but... But Jared, there's only 20 seconds left. You have to be prepared. I'm ready. Over. Fifteen seconds. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Go! No! Oh god! Oh god! Oh my god! That is so loud. Someone help! Oh my! It's getting really bright out there. Oh my god! That's so bright. You're done. Oh my god, there's a light getting reflected out of that side. Ah, Jared! Dust is getting into my closet! Yes, I'm flooding my nose, but I it's hard to because I'm holding the camera and the walkie-talkie. Jokes. There's a real life nuke happening. Sorry, I make jokes when I'm scared. Okay, but it's getting really bright out there. I'm almost gonna get blind. Jared, respond. Well, you better close your eyes if there's if it's too bright. I'm just looking. I'm just looking away. So Jared, the nuke hasn't touched us yet, but it will in 10 seconds. All right, I'm ready. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh! oh my God. Jared, my closet fell onto its side. Okay. Um, my head got hurt a little bit. Find a band-aid 
all the destruction will be so devastating. Shoes go. I don't know. They got knocked off somewhere. Just make sure you take your socks off if you don't want your clothes to get wet. I said this the last time we saw the nuke. I'm just reminding you. Alright guys. It might have been hard to tell, but I just cut the video. And I don't hear any more sounds. I think it's safe, so I'm going to tell Jared. Hey, Jared? Yes, Nick. Over. I don't hear any sounds. I think it's safe to get out. All right. Should I come up there? Not yet. I'm just going to make sure it's safe by looking through my crack. I need to make sure all the fallout doesn't fall on top of us. Okay, sounds good. Over. I just looked out there, and I think I see fallout starting to fall from the sky. I think I see the fallout falling, so let's stay in here for a little bit longer. All right, sounds good. Over. Yeah, because the fallout is radioactive. All right, guys, I'm going to cut the video again. It might have been hard to tell, but I cut the video. It's hard to tell when it's really dark, but I cut the video, and when I look outside, I see that all the fallout is gone. So I'm going to tell Jared. Jared, I think it's safe because all the fallout is gone. It's only on the ground now. Just make sure it doesn't touch your mouth, and then you're going to get radiation. Okay, should I come up? Yes. You should come up, but... Jared? I just need to make sure we... We have a pathway, because... Because I don't want to step on that fallout. Okay, I'm coming up now. Good. Okay, I'm up. Yo, my doors are burned up again. Jared says he's upstairs where the house got destroyed. Really? Oh my god. Oh my gosh. This is nothing like all the other disasters. The nuke must have been closer this time. I'm going to set the walkie-talkie on the floor right here. Jared, you see all this? I don't even th I don't even think the walkie-talkie is functional anymore. Yeah. We probably lost signal cuz when I try to talk on it it's not working. Nothing. Hmm. So I think it lost signal. Yeah. We're going to have to buy some new ones when people rebuild this place. Okay. Yeah, this is a lot of destruction. Oh my god. Look, there's look Look, that house is completely gone. Like I, I like I only see the foundation and there's my closet. See it's all burnt up. Yep. But all the fallout is on the ground. I see it. We need to make sure we don't step on it. Hold on, there's a piece of there's one more piece of fallout falling from the sky. Oh, watch out. Um get out of the way, get out of the way. Uh. Yes, he dodged it. Don't step on it. Okay. I'm going to use this piece of metal to walk across the fallout so I don't get destroyed by it. Okay, sounds good. All right, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video, but hopefully they rebuild this place when I wake up because 
The last two times I went to sleep in all this destruction and woke up, I woke up back in our house where they have rebuilt everything and placed everything where it's supposed to go. But guys, subscribe, like, ring the bell. Goodbye.